Well, when you get offered any sort of credit, and banks love to um, offer credit to what they you know, call good customers, you've got to remember that the best customer for a bank uh, is a customer who borrows quite a lot of money on their credit card and then can't quite pay it all off. So they're paying some back, so the bank's not losing their money that way, but they're also getting charged loads of interest on top of that. So it's really important if you get offered a credit card or something like that to be thinking, actually, do I need it? Is there anything that I you know, really need to be buying on the credit card, or am I just going to be spending it on stuff that I want um, that I might struggle to pay for later? Working out whether you're going to be able to afford to pay it off is absolutely crucial. Don't ever borrow money if you're not sure uh, how you're going to be able to afford it later. Um, and make sure you understand the product that you're being offered. Just because your bank says, oh, you're a really good customer, we want to give you this really shiny gold card or whatever it happens to be, make sure you understand exactly how much that's going to cost you, exactly what the rates of interest are on it. So that if you do get hold of those kind of products, which can be a really good thing, can be really useful, you're able to manage them well and make sure you're getting the most out of them. When you're using a credit card, we would generally think it's not a good idea to be putting uh, sort of day-to-day -day shopping on it. So you shouldn't be really doing your food shop on your credit card. That's a sign that actually you might be struggling financially in other areas. But for big items, so if you're buying something like a, a holiday or um, you know, maybe a new computer or something that you can't afford right now but you want to be able to pay off um, over a certain length of time, then it can be really useful. Um, for stuff like holidays or shopping abroad, you actually get a bit more protection if you're shopping with a credit card. If something goes wrong and the holiday company goes bust or something like that, then the credit card company actually has to refund you. So for those kind of items, uh, using a credit card can be, a, can be a really good idea. But only if you know you're going to have the money coming in later to be able to pay it off. Really, you should be able to pay off your credit card in full every month. Uh, but even if you're not, you need to be able to make sure that there's going to be enough income coming in later so that you are able to clear that balance eventually. So if you borrow, let's say, £2,000 uh, on a credit card and only pay the minimum, it'll take you 20 years uh, to clear that balance off. And by that time, you'll have paid hundreds of hundreds of pounds in interest. So whatever it was that you bought in the first place, you'll have ended up paying way, way more than it was actually worth. So just paying the minimum is never a great idea. Really, you should be looking to pay more than the minimum, and if at all possible, pay the whole thing off.